How's it going guys? Today we're going to start with the actual process of modding a map. So the first thing I'm going to need is a map that I'm going to start modding. So if I navigate here to my Westwood Red Alert 2 folder and I go into maps and I go into Use Revenge, here I have all the maps that come with the client. So I'm just going to choose one of these. Let's say uh, Heck is a good one. I love Heck. Let's see if I could find it here. Uh, I could just search heck. Um, there we go. Heck freeze is over. LE map. So I'm just going to take this map and open it up. Again, you're going to want to do edit with Notepad++ or open with and always open this type of file with Notepad++. If I just open heck, we have the map file here. And the first thing I'm going to want to do is go up to language and go to I and hit I and I file. This way it colors everything in in a clear way where I can mod easily everything I'm trying to do. Now I'm going to go to rules empty. Let's say the unit I want to mod is the rhino. So I'm just going to hit control F. This is the search. And if I type rhino here and just hit enter, you see commented out here is the rhino heavy tank. Now, HDNK is what it's called. This is called the section of the file. So this is the HTNK uh, section of the file. And this, when you add a semicolon, this means this is commented out. This, the game will not read. So thankfully, RulesMD does have a lot of comments to help us find stuff. So if I hit Rhino, it's commented here. And in the name, it's also it's Rhino Heavy Tank. So I'm just going to copy this, right? Hit Control C, and in my file, right at the top, just so it's easy for me to find, I paste HTNK. So here I have a lot of options of things I can mod, and there's a lot of options that aren't here that I can mod, but everything about the Rhino tank is already here. So let's say I want to change the speed of the Rhino tank. So I'm just going to copy this, and the speed is 6. So if I just change this to, let's say, about 50, right, and then I save this map and actually run it, which we'll do in a sec, you'll see the Rhino take all of a sudden moves at the speed of light. So they literally, that is it. Now, you're going to see a lot of flags here under the Rhino tank, right? All different kind of things that you aren't going to understand. Wait, what does this do? Right, uh, maybe perhaps crate goodie. Wait, what? What is that? Owner. Well, what is that? Who? Who are the Russians? What's the Confederation? Right, and so on and so forth. So anything you don't know what it does, obviously we'll try to cover as much as possible in this tutorial. But really, all you do is you copy it. All right, and there is an online site where you can search these things. If you just type in Google mod ENC, which is a mod encyclopedia right and sorry mod enc right right over here mod encyclopedia then you just paste it here in the search bar right so speed and then it will go into all the details right uh on what it is so on object type right specifies the movement speed of this object type so that is great We've just modded the Rhino tank to move much faster. Now we're going to test it and see if it works. So first thing first is where do I save this? So I click save as. And again, I navigate to if I go to uh, Westwood Red Alert 2 and then I go into maps. Now I want to go into custom. This is where I'm going to be saving it. We're going to make sure that the extension down here is dot map. All right, and I'm just going to copy the name here because we're going to need that in a second. So, heck freeze over dot map, save it in the customs folder and just hit the save button. Um, now, if I go into the client and we're just going to load up the lobbies, this is going to take a second. So while we're doing that, let's talk about the name of the map. So right in the map, if I just search for basic, it's a lot of basic information. And one of the things are name right the name of the map now i don't want it to be called heck freezes over le because then you know if someone joins my lobby and downloads the map he thinks it's regular heck and all of a sudden rhinos are moving really fast so i'm going to want to add mod 
test or something like that or you know uh, fast rhino mod so if I just add that in there if we go into the type of map um, game mode it's called here game mode so game mode is a battle red alert to ladder map and use revenge ladder maps we're just gonna add standard in here right standard standard I spelled that wrong standard uh, so if I just add that and then again I hit the control s key for save so control s to save and then I just hit the up key for my last command so it's load map again hit enter so now if I search for fast rhino mod it shows up in standard here so if I click that here we go we've got heck and if I choose Iraq we're just gonna lower this down and let's launch the game here and have a look at these fast rhinos create a war factory as you can see the dogs are moving at normal speed unchanged completely regular in a second we're gonna have a look at the rhinos and they're gonna be scary so there we go, War Factory is ready, and now we're just going to make a few rhinos here. I just turned the game sound on so that you could hear it, but look at that. I tell the rhino to move, and it just zooms across the map super fast. So... We've successfully created our first modded map where the rhinos are just insanely fast.